We'll see how this goes. Mm -hmm. So you had I a good took, trip? I took out a window air conditioner when I got home from work tonight and tweaked my back a little bit. Oh, no. Oops. How this goes. I took a Robaxa sip. We'll see. The trip was great. When did you get back? Um, I got home about 12, 30, quarter to one last night. Oh, wow. Okay. The flight landed between 10, 30 and 11. But by the time I got home yeah. and then I was wired because I grabbed a tea on my way out of the airport. So I was like, I need something. And <laughs> then I was, you know, staring at the ceiling until about 2.30 this morning. And then at five o'clock, Kat decided he needed to be fed. Yeah, they do that. And then, of course, Newfoundland time's an hour and a half ahead. So that's right. It, yeah. it, was, it was a short night, a long day. Yeah. I'm glad you had a good trip. Yes. Considering where you were and uh, all the craziness that was going on that way, I'm just glad well, you were safe. But I was way up at the at the northwest end and it was way down at the southeast end like you know, oh, okay you know it's, it's a huge island newfoundland so right miles, and miles hours and hours away from me so it was windy on saturday when i did my first hike but it was windy well, that it was okay yeah yeah lots and lots and lots of climbing and stairs and cliffs and I had a uh, hundred when I added all my flights of stairs up last night. What, no, last night, I guess. Yeah, I guess I was sitting in the airport and I was bored. So I was going through 633 flights of stairs. Oh my goodness. Recorded uh, almost 110,000 steps and 70 miles or something. Wow. But I mean, it was mostly, you know, up and down and up and down and up and down and up and down. And... Yeah, I can see that uh, definitely being interesting. And beautiful scenery. I recorded a whole lot of wave sounds. <laughs> mm, that's cool. I'm glad. I'm glad you had a good time. Mm-hmm. The only day, and it was hot there. I didn't have really? a day. I didn't have a day where the high was below 20. Wow. 26. Okay. Right. It was 26 on Tuesday. I was hiking up and down all over um, Signal Hill and just dripping. <laughs> I took all these warm clothes and regretted all the warm clothes. Yeah. Yeah, well, we've got uh, Killarney next weekend, so mm. we're kind of wondering what we're going to be having weather-wise. Mm -hmm. so. Should be interesting. So you can use your kettlebell tonight. You've got one. I've got five. So kettlebell, Six. dumbbell. Minium. There's Mrs. Brown. <laughs> Welcome back. Thank you. Did you have a good hey, time? Jamie. Hey, Jamie. Great time. Lovely. The flights are okay? Yep. Good, good. I would, I would use links again. Yeah. And now they're introducing um, Vegas, LA, four or five different, Orlando, a bunch of different spots uh, in yeah. November, or, no, January, maybe that's when they start. You can start booking them in November, but January, I think they start flying to those locations. Right. I can fly to Hall Halifax for $59. What are you doing next weekend? Want to go for Thanksgiving? That's insanity. <laughs> How do they get away with that? And then no food, no bells and whistles. If you want to take a carry on other than like a personal handbag size, okay. like a tiny backpack, um, it's extra. If you want checked in, it's extra. If you 
you'll want to choose your and seat. How much, and how much extra? Like a lot. I paid no, I paid $46 for my um suitcase that I took as a carry-on to put up in the thing. Okay. My head. Wow. I mean my whole my whole return flight was $337. That's crazy. Pretty good. And then I got a coupon the day after I booked it that I could have got it cheaper had I waited. Oh. You know, you can't to change it like it costs bucks to. You know, right. I would have saved a hundred bucks, but it would have cost me seventy nine and cancellation fees and stuff to do it. It wasn't worth the hassle. We looked at doing swoop to BC, but. We did swoop. I think it was swoop. Yeah, out of Hamilton. Yeah, yeah. They're actually out of uh, Pearson now, now too. Yeah, they've got them. Oh, are they? Okay. Yeah, yeah when wasn't they first started. It for us. Yeah. We got, but we got the flight. We paid one hundred and seventy dollars per person to go out to BC. Hmm. Well, that was Canada. Before, that was at the beginning of COVID. So. Yeah. Right. Yeah, we got yeah. the same prices on flight that there. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. Yeah, and, and that, that was, was with like all your money Canada? paid for. So we didn't pay anything extra for anything. Although I hate flying Air Canada. Hey, we were just happy to be flying somewhere. <laughs> that is also true. <laughs> it was kind of a you know special occasion. Yeah, kind of. Kind of. But even now, like I went to go book us up plane ticket um, to go out west again in December to go skiing. And had I booked it um, months and months ago now, they were still only, what were they, hun? Like they were around two, two, some, 200. They were around, yes, high twos to early threes. Yeah. Um, they still weren't bad, but it was just because you booked you booked early. If you book early, they're not crazy expensive. About three minutes. Oh man. I'd like to go out east. I've never been out east. But I want to camp. I want to that's how my brother did Camping it. would be more fun. Yeah. Yeah, he camped along the way. They drove out and camped and uh, had a heck of a time. It was amazing. The pictures were gorgeous. I had great Airbnbs. I mean, they were yeah. right trails and the one guy, you know, his cabin was so adorable. The little um, trapper's cabin. I mean, it was so friendly. And yeah. Just... Yeah, your pictures were awesome. Oh, that's... I had the digital camera with me and so it's full. I got to download it, but you know, last night I did not get home in time. I've been at work all day. So, and there's a whack on my phone. <laughs> got to go through yet too. Yeah. My brother had this like campsite um, on a cliff overlooking the ocean. Mm. So when he stood back and took the picture, there was like nothing around them, but their tent and the ocean. And I was like, Oh my God. Yeah, freaking phenomenal. Some people hike the East Coast Trail and hike and camp. Like there's, you know, some people stop in places. Some people mm -hmm. trail or yeah. campsites and stuff off of it. Yeah, we want to do the West Coast Trail as well. We did. We were on part of that when we were out there. Slept on the beach. We did sleep on the beach. Sombrio Beach. Yeah, good memory. Occasionally. Got about a minute and a half. There's Dina. Hi, Dina. Oh, is the hubby doing the workout with us? Yay! No, what do you mean? No. Ah. <laughs> Oh, Tiffany's in, Kenny's in, Jamie's in. So you'll need a dumbbell uh, or kettlebell. Dumbbell or kettlebell. You want to get a kettlebell out? 
even get a oh, hammer cowbell. Oh, good gravy. To. Then it can be hammer time. Do, do. I need my pants, my hammer time pants. Do, do. Can't touch the do, do, do. No. <laughs> Oh, come on. Uh huh. I'm getting my dancing pants on. I'm ready. Yeah, getting ready for the gala. I'm getting ready for the gala. Dancing pants. Yeah. Yeah, we've got all the requests for a dance floor, so we're fighting hard trying to find some place that can. Has the benefit of the place? <laughs> with, uh, with food and beverages and uh, dance, dance floor. floor, and we've got a DJ, I think. Coach Joe's got somebody in mind, so. Just need a location that's somewhere close to Markham, hopefully. So. Uh, Are you ready? I think it's already started. Beautiful. It is 7.30, so let's get started. Happy Thursday, everybody. Welcome to Fight Fit Online. I'm Coach Mark. Kristen is with me. This is the Fight Inspired Interval Training. This is the fit class. So tonight, it's going to be high-intensity intervals. It's going to be a mixture of cardio core with a little bit of strength training. So as I said, a dumbbell, a kettlebell, something that you could use with two hands and in some cases one hand. But uh, there's only three exercises we're going to be using the weights for. So let's get started. A little bit of mobility as we always do. A little bit of a neck roll and start going side to side. So yes, December the 10th is the day that we have slotted for the holiday gala. So you definitely won't want to miss that. Coach Joe knows how to put on a party. So come on out and join us for that. As soon as we have a location nailed down, that will be announced. There is a uh, Facebook event group already. If you're not a part of it, let us know. We'll get you a part of it. Yeah, let's get those shoulders going. Nice big rotation. Speaking of exciting things, this Saturday, 8.30 a.m. will be the first um, combat conditioning camp, the Triple C class online. You can only get it online. And we're only going to do it here. So if you want to join us, it's 60 minutes long, not this 45, but 60 minutes. So combination of kickboxing and fit. So you're going to get everything in this one. It's almost like a mini annihilator. So oh. it's going to be a ton of fun. Prepare to be annihilated. Absolutely. So don't miss that. So 8.30 on Saturday is the very first one. Let's go over and close. Going to be some fun. Looking forward to that one. Fun. Mm -hmm. My style of fun anyway. Mm. Might even be simple. Who knows? Let's keep those legs out. Nice oh. and tall. You're not going anywhere. It's been a long week. I don't know why, but it has been a long week. Well, the good news is for you, it's basically Friday. It is. I have a PA day tomorrow. Although, PA days mean that I have to sit in a cold gym with a bunch of other adults listening to the principal talk. Let's see. Yes. This one. Good. Let's twist it out. I don't really much like sitting in the cold gym. I can see that. I can relate to that somewhat. Yes. <laughs> Especially when, you know, January hits. Yes. Oh, God. Okay, I'll bring a blankie. Yes, I wouldn't be surprised if you did. <sighs> yeah, let's come back. Let's reach over the top. Let's push that hip out. Big reach, try and loosen up hip. And the bonus Lots. part is just that I get to wear comfy clothes tomorrow. True. So you mean you're not gonna do the Terry Fox run in your dress clothes and dress boots tomorrow? No, no. You did that yesterday, so you don't have to do it tomorrow? I forgot my gym clothes yesterday for the Terry Fox run, but Miss, Miss Beer, she ran quad K in her dress boots, and now I'm <laughs> suffering for it. Because a 40 or 40 year old should not be running in dress boots. <laughs> Apparently, I'm not no longer 20. Well, I don't think the age has anything to do with it. I think it's just a silly idea. Oh so, no, yeah. I think if I was 20, I would have bounced back. <laughs> I had more elasticity back then. 
Oh. 20 years ago, I was more elastic. I was like Elastigirl. Now, not so much. I'm getting old like you, huh? Ah, uh, never. <laughs> Unicorns are immortal, aren't they? I think so. Last one. Good. Up nice and tall. Let's bring those hands up with that big twist. Knees, keep them wide. Big half rotation. Might be a few people here that uh, survived my noon hour. What was it? Uh, it wasn't noon hour. It was uh, about the bit class I did yesterday. It was uh, a little psychotic. I was at the gym. Was Tina there? Uh, yes, you know what? So she survived. We know that. So, well, she's pretty hearty. She is. Yeah. She's kind of like the Energizer Bunny. Oh. Or is that Duracell? I can't remember which. What? Energizer. Oh, no, that's it. It was Timex. Timex. Okay. Keeps on going. Keeps on ticking. Keeps that's on ticking. There you go. I hope they're not calling her old. No. Okay. Just check it. Oh. There we go. This one. Good one. Widen that stance and we're out. Reach up. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, oh Terry Fox run, you kicked my butt. <laughs> I think you kicked your own butt. Oh, table. Nice deep squat. Don't worry. We're gonna. Quite a few squats coming tonight, so we'll get those legs warm. But don't worry, it's not leg day. This will definitely be a total body workout. Last one. And good. Let's get a little bit of leg cardio. Start off with that jog. Three, two. Now, Just... I'm reading the bottom part of this board. <laughs> I think that is not for the unicorn. I think that is for you. Could be. Just want to make that clear now. That is not unicorn approved. No, just have to see how it goes. I don't like the name of it either. So three, two, let's go fast beat. Pedaling quick. Gotta stay in the moment. Focus on what's ahead of you. Well, it's right in now. really big writing. <laughs> I just have to glance down. You're always complaining. I'm not reading the board. Yes, well, you could start at the top. I nice said, quick. Well, I saw the second exercise. I didn't like that either. So I just kind of skipped. Here we go. Three, two. Let's go, little Jack. Elbows up, shoulder high. Oh, there's lots of cool stuff to come. Thanks. Well, maybe just hops. Like I'm seeing much I like in this. What the heck? I was all the way up. Is this a new one? Nope. Oh. oh there's, there's, yes. Is this named? Does it have a name? Well, you can help me name it after the end of the workout. Okay. There's that pattern. All right. Starting off nice oh. and simple. You're going to start feet shoulder width, drop squat. Little hop forward, drop squat, hop forward. Nice and simple. Let's start it off. Okay. 30 second intervals. I got this. In three, two, let's go. A little drop squat, little hop. I feel like a bunny. That's it. Je suis une la paix. I see lots of little bunnies in here. I see we got Cecilia's in here. We got Jamie. T and Cinnamon's going for it. Madeline's going, Rose is going for it. Guinea jumping in. There we go. Tiffany and little one going for it. Your has got it. Oh, so Dina does have a helper going for it. <laughs> we got Tanya and Teresa as always. Two, one second exercise. We got four little press jacks or jumping oh. jack. Just nice and simple. Then you're going to sprawl. And then come up with a jump tuck. That's the TNT. 
So modification can be your four step squats. You can squat down, step back, step back up, and then do a double knee up. So that'll be the modified version, whichever version you got. Let's go three, two, let's get four jacks, two, three, four, sprawl it out, shoot those legs back, come up, jump, tuck, beautiful. Let's get it in gear, folks. Let's push, let's push, let's go. Let's get that heart rate up. Let's start burning that body fat, burning those calories. It's Thursday night, been a long week for a lot of people, but keep on moving. That's it. Those four little jacks. Oh, Dina's rocking it. Dean and Hubby going for it. We got two. Oh. We got one. And Chris and I are switching. So we yes, got four pulse squats. So we're going to take a little bit wide on the shoulder. We're going to come down into that squat. So sitting back with that big hinge. One, two, three, four little pulses, only moving about two inches. And then we're going to get a little squat hop. But right back in the squat. So, so I'm sitting back with that squat. All right. So knees over ankles. Let's go in three. Two. Timer's on. You can always one, do a calf two, three, raise. Four. Pop. Pop. So, as Kristen's talking about, if you get those four pulses, then just lift the heels. Two, three, four. Four. That's it, Teresa. Four. No jet lag for you, two, girl. Three, four. That's it, Tanya and Bella. Good work, Tina and husband. <laughs> That's it, Hira. Uh, good job, Tiffany and little one. <laughs> and time. All right, second, or next one. We got four high knees. One sprawl, come back, get your push up. Oh, good gravy. Modification right. can be push up from the knees. <laughs> Here we go. Three, two, timer's on. <laughs> That's it, Kenny. Good job, Rosa. Nice, Jamie, getting those knees up nice and high. A little higher, Madeline, get those knees up. Keep going, Cecilia. 10 seconds, let's go, give me a few more. Push, push, push. Go, go, go. One more, one more, one more rep. And time, good. Person's up. Oh man, my turn already. Yeah, cross country skiers that you can't see because somebody got in my way. You don't know how to cross country ski anyway. Oh, uh, let's go in three, two, let's go. So little hops, kind of like you're doing jump switches. But try to be as quick and as fluid as you can. That's it. You can hop it or you can step it, whatever you got. That's it, looking good. Keep going, nice Tiffany. Go to your, uh, go for it, Jamie. Go Madeline, Satya, and time. All right, so for this one, you're gonna start feet together. You're gonna step out to the side. You're gonna get a side lunge. And as you come forward or come back to where you started, you're gonna go right into a front kick with that same leg. So step over. No, we're just doing one side. Oh, oh what well, geez Louise, man, okay. Step over, lunge, front kick. All one side, lunge and front kick. Let's go in three, two, let's go for it. Lunge. And front kick, keep those hands up. Lunge and front kick. Right up there, I see Shanali just joined us. Welcome. Let's go. Stepping off, just the one side. We're not alternating. Step lunge and front kick. I don't care if you're doing a push kick or a snap kick, just kick it up there. You got five, sorry, almost five, four. Right up there, keep that chest up. Two. And time. Other side? Nope. Oh, you know what that means, peoples. Yep, you get one more chance to go through everything. All right, so next exercise, 
that leg that was doing the movement. Okay, that's still the one doing the movement. So the other one, the stationary, you're going to be leaning over top of that leg. Hands are extended. That leg that was moving continues to move with power and ease. Let's get it nice and quick. Leaning over that quad, get it bent, get it ready. Full extension. Timer's on. Back's nice and straight and flat. Feel the glutes, you feel the abs, you feel those lungs if you're going fast enough. Oh man, that is awesome, Tiffany. She's going to town there. Good girl. <laughs> uh, keep going, Ira. Right, good job. That's it, Jamie. Wrap them out. Come on, Madeline, you got it. Lean a little bit more forward, Madeline. A little bit more forward. Lean. That's it. You got it, Tia. Come on. And time. All right. Your tips up. So we're going to get. An oblique jack times two, times two, then one, two, three, four. So two, two, then alternate for four. All right, timer is on. One, two, one, two, one, two, three, four. Oh, Bella thinks it's playtime. <laughs> That's a day you keep going. Good, Dina. That's it, Rosa. Really crunching those obliques. Nice, Kenny. Good. Keep going. Keep going. That's it, Teresa. You got it, Tiffany. Three seconds. Give me a few more. And time. The corn's up. So it's time to grab your dumbbell or your kettlebell. So if you got a dumbbell, you're going to take it, hold it onto the, the head by like this, and sit back, and you're going to hike through two kettlebell style swings, then grab it with both hands and get a horn squat, basically. Then back again, swing, use the hips, bring that up. We grab horn squat with a kettlebell. Hello. Yeah, that's me. So hike, swing, swing, come up, re grab. Nope. What? Oh, man. Other way. Oh, but it was there so it is. And then the horn squat. So, whichever version of toy you've got, let's get it in three, two, let's go for it. Timer's on. So don't flatten the back, don't look down, look forward with this. Swing, swing into that horn squat or that grab and then get that squat, nice. That's it. The Tiffany, so don't let that kettlebell swing higher than your shoulders. It should be right clavicle high. Stay in control of it, there you go, much better. Nice, Jamie. That'll work, Madeline. And time. Second one is we're just going to lean over. Whether you got dumbbell or kettlebell, doesn't matter right now. So you're going to get into a staggered stance. Right? And we're going to get that kettlebell. Actually, don't want a staggered stance. We want a neutral stance because you're going to alternate arms. So row oh. and row. Sorry. Oh. So row. And row. So alternating arms. Ready? Three, two, let's go for it. So keep that abs engaged, protect that lower back, and pull with that row. Straight up, back nice and flat, and row. Really working on those triceps, working on the back, working on the chest as well. Make sure you're sitting back. Get that squat. That's it. That'll work, Madeline. Keep going. Sit to you. Nice, Rosa. Got to get some of you folks a little heavier weight. That's okay. We got something at least. That's all that matters. Something. Water bottle, can of beans. It's all good. Get something. Madeline's adapting. Love it. Right up there. Nice, Jamie. Two. One. And next one. Oh, I got a 
I do it, and then you can do the next one. All right, that's fine. Okay. So next one, if you've got the kettlebell, you're going to take it in a regular grip, but it's still a kettlebell swing, style of swing, but we're alternating arms. So back, up, grab, switch, sit back with the hips, fire up. So I don't want to see this as too much on the lower back. You're hinging back with the hips, chest is up on that slight vertical. All right, so the kettlebell, it's a little bit harder, but let's go for it in three, two, let's get it. Kettlebell swing or with the dumbbell, whichever you've got, but start with that hike underneath and behind you and then swing up and switch hands. I like to switch out front. There we go. Good, Jamie. Good, Rosa. Oh. Good, Dina. Keep looking forward. Good, Tanya. Good, Teresa. That uh, looks pretty fancy, Tiffany. Good. Right up there, Kenny. We got three. We got two. And put those weights aside. We're done with them for now. Now it's time to come down the floor. I'm gonna get a little bit of a wide stance, wide arms, wide feet. So we go into downward facing dog. We're gonna get a reach and a reach. Then we're gonna come back, a little tuck in. Push back, reach, opposite hand, opposite leg, opposite hand, opposite leg. Come forward like a plank, tuck in, tuck back. That's it, that's all. Let's go for it. Here we go. Three, two, time is on. Push back, reach, reach. On that push back, really try to make sure that your legs are straight, knees are not bent. Push back, reach, reach. That's it, Tiffany. Nice. Yep. And that's it. And then push back again. Yep. You got it, Tiffany. Yep. Good stuff. That's it, Ira. Good. Nice, Jamie. Good, Madeline. And time. Ooh. So we're coming down to a low plank now. That's the good news. So elbows underneath your armpits, feet shoulder wet. You're going to reach, reach, come up, shoulder tap. Shoulder tap, back down. You want to put your weight out there and use that as a target for your double tap. Perfectly fine. Either way, let's get it going. Here we go. Timer is on. So you're just tapping forward and then up and up in those shoulders. Nice, Tanya. That's it, Dina. Good, Teresa. That's it, Kenny. You got it, Rose. Awesome. Good tea and cinnamon. That's it, Madeline. Really engage those abs. Make sure that your back is flat and time. All right. Oh, I guess I'm going to take this one. Yeah, you are. I'll take this one for the team. Uh -huh. so we're back to that wide feet, wide hands. Downward facing dog into an upward facing dog, basically back in a plank. One, two, three, four mountain climbers. So the dive bomb style push up to plank, four mountain climbers, two per leg. Okay, here we go. Timer is on. So if you wanted to modify this one, you could put glutes up and then just bring the hips down. Then go to plank, bring those knees up, or get that dive, come up, and sprint. Nice, Rosa. That's it, Kenny. Beautiful, Jamie. Good, Madeline. Good pushback. Yep. And time. Whew. All right. 
Unicorn's coming up to the top. Oh, no, but I agree. Drop squat with that forward hop. Let's go. Three, two, no weights. Drop squat, forward hop. Drop squat, forward hop. Let's get out those little itty bitty bunnies and get it in gear. That's it. Right down. You can sidestep those squats if you want to, or just get the hop, whatever you got. Right down, right up. Keep going, Shanali. Rocket Cecilia, that's it. Nice to you. You got it, Madeline, right down. Nice, Jamie. And time for Jax with the TNT, which is the sprawl into the jump tuck. Two, one, let's go. Those four oh. jacks. Into that sprawl with the jump tuck. That's the TNT. Come on, unicorn. One, two, three, four. Sprawl it out. Pop those legs right up into that jump tuck. That's it. I know it's starting to get hard, but you got to go. Jamie's going for it. That's it. Keep going, Madeline. Good, Tiffany. Good. Nice, Kenny. Up there. Good, Rosa. We got five seconds. Keep going, Tanya. Keep going. Two, one, and it is time. Pulse squats. We got four pulse squats with one squat hop. So coming down to that bottom part of the squat, four little pulses. Let's go in three, two, and one, two, three, four, up, right down. Four, pop, down, two, three, four, in the air. One, two, three, four. Land soft, ninja like. That's it. You guys got it. Keep going, Cecilia. You got it, Shalani. That's it, Tia. Nice, Madeline. Just for Jamie. And time. Good, Rosa. Yeah. And time. Four high knees, one sprawl, one push up. Timer is on. One, two, three, four. Crawling it out and a push up. Ooh, that Bella, she's spicy tonight. That's it, Tanya. Maybe your mom's feeling spicy too. <laughs> Good, Teresa. It's like you weren't even on vacation, Teresa. You got just as much energy as always. Yeah, <laughs> she says no, but it looks like it. That's it, Dina. And time. All right, here corns up. Cross country skiers. Oh. Two, one, let's go. Just those little hops, leaning forward. Nice, Rosa. Sick, good kitty. Go, Tiffany. Need a little bit more forward here, huh? Good, nice, Jamie. Good, Madeline. It's, yeah, 12 seconds. Keep going, folks. Push, 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 push. A little faster if you got it. Last five seconds. Switching those legs. Switch, 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 switch. One, two, oh. one, two. And time. Now we've got the side lunge on the other side in that front kick. Here we go. Three, two, let's go. Step off. Come up with that kick. Step off, sit back, come up with that kick. That's it. We're almost there, folks. <laughs> Tiffany's got some help now. <laughs> now. Keep looking up here, huh? Keep looking straight ahead. Don't bow down. Don't bow. It's all about a single leg squat, basically, and that lunge all the way over using the opposite leg to last time. And time. All right, we've got. Just so you know, you're doing kettlebell stuff this time. Uh huh. <laughs> so we got the power knees on that opposite leg, full extension. Get that nice long lunge. Here we go. Timer's on. That's it. Good, Rosa. Leaning a little bit more forward. 
That's it, Kenny. Good, Dina. That's it, Ira. Try to keep your head in line with your spine. So don't uh, bring your head too far forward. Five seconds. Keep pushing, Cecilia. Go. That's it, Shalani. And time. Ooh, that burns the legs. We got those oblique jacks. Two, two, and one, two, three, four. Timer's on. That's it. Come on, little one. Go with mom. Do those exercises. <laughs> Keep going, Teresa. You got it, Tanya. That's it, Dina. Let's go, let's go. 10 seconds. Come on. Wrap them out. Come on. You got it, Ira. Go, go, go. That's it, Tiffany. Come on, Kenny. And time. Grab your kettlebell or your dumbbell. All right, kettlebell, dumbbell. Here we go. We are just doing two swings with that horn squat, really hinging at the hip. Sit back, bell on the edge. Timer is on. Hike under one, two, re grab, down for that squat, push it out. One, two, nice. re grab, squat, push it out. Good, Madeline. That's it, Jamie. Keep going. That's it, Dina. Tanya, that bell should be a little higher up when you're swinging, like not low, like higher up in between your legs. And time. Second right. one, alternating rows. I'm going to hinge back, brace with one hand, other hand is down, and pull this right up beside me, staying flat back. All right. Alternating sides. Timer is on. There we go. You should feel the tricep. The lats, positioning wise, you're going to feel the glutes. That's it, hamstrings. Yeah. Good. That's it, Dina. Nice, Tanya. Good form, Teresa. Three seconds. Give me a few more, Rosa. That's it, Kenny. And time. All right. Kettlebell swings. Alternating. Your alternating arms. Okay, timer is on, alternating kettlebell swings, really hinging at those hips. Some of you are leaning over a little bit too far. You take a look at coach Mark spine and hinge. Don't wanna be leaning over too far. You don't want the kettlebell to really drop too far below your knees. If you've got a tall one, it'll, it will, but it really should go close to your legs. And time. Unicorns up. You get to finish it. Downward dog, two reach backs plus the tuck in. Let's go in three, two, let's go. So wide feet, wide hands. Reach back, reach back. Come back to plank, pull the knees in, push the feet out. Just like that, Jamie. The Rosa. Good, Dina. That's it. You can step them in or, or jump them, whichever you got. Good, dear, how good. Nice, Madeline. Good, just like that. That's it. Good to you. Two. One and time. We're now going into that low plank. We got two forward reaches, one per arm. Then come up to high plank. Get those two shoulder taps. Keep that core engaged. Stay nice and flat. Let's go in three, two. Let's go. Low plank. Reach forward, reach forward. Come up. High plank. Double shoulder tap. Back down. 
Take your time with this. No need for speed. It's all about the form. Your core should be engaged, should be flat backed. That's it. Keep going. You got it, Rosa. Oh, that's one time. Nice, Jamie. Fifteena, keep going, Tanya. Sit, hips down a little bit more, Madeline. Yep, hips, hips down, hips down. Two, one, and now you're gonna go back to the wide feet, wide hands, dive bomber push up with four mountain climbers. Let's go in three, two. Let's go for it. Dive down, come up to plank. One, two, three, four. Back in. Dive down, come up, four climbers, one, two, three, four. That's it. Keep coming. Good, Rosa. Sit right down there, nice, Jamie. Go for it, Cecilia. Go, Chanelle. Yep, hips forward. That's it, Madeline. Yep, hips down. Hips down on those mountain climbers. Shoulders should be over top of your wrists. We got three. We got two. And the good news is we are coming back to the top. Oh my gosh, no. But the other really good news is, is now we have 20 second sprints. Oh, dear Lord. So now, if you thought you were going fast before, now you're really going for it. So drop squat, forward hop. Let's go for it. Timer is on. <laughs> we're on our usual punishment tonight. Oh, dang it, you look like a little bunny. So did Kenny. We're bunnies tonight. You can always do a backward hop. That's it, Madeline. Oh, T has got another fluffy friend there. And, and time. Four jacks, one TMT. Timer is on. One, two, three, four. And down with that. Go all into a jump. Make sure your hands are touching at the top of that jack all the way up, arms fully extended. That's it. And time. Arms up, four full squats, one squat hop. Two, one, let's go. Right down, four pulses, one hop. Right down with that squat, sitting back. Or as you can, knees over ankles, not toes. That's it, pulse, 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 and pop. Hurry. And time, four high knees. One sprawl, one push up. Let's go. Get them up there, one, two, three, four. Sprawl it out. Get that plank and that push up. That's it, gotta be quick. Don't have much time. Only have eight seconds left. Hurry, hurry. Two, one, cross country skiers coming up. Get that opposite lunge, arms extended. Two, one. Nice, simple one. That's it. Go easy, dear. Tina, go easy. Just step it if you need to, step it. You can always Don't step. Don't file it if you can't. Step. Yeah, there you go. That's it. And time. Speaking of stepping, we have a side lunge, front kick, alternating legs this time, or alternating sides. Good. Three, two, numbers on. That's it. That's it, Kenny. Good, Madeline. That's it, Tia. Keep going, Cecilia and Shalani. Got it, Jamie. Good kicks, Rosa. That's it, Dina. And time. Corns up, power knees. Got to do this one twice for each side. Oh, no. Here we go. Two, one, over one leg. Let's go. Rep it out. Lean it over, top of that knee. Hurry, hurry. Thick, quick as you can, leaning forward. Big, big, long lunge. Pull it in, push it out, pull it in, push it out. Two, one, switch legs. Two, one, let's go, right in. No rest, all go. Hurry, hurry. That's it. We got 10 seconds. 
Come on, go, 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 go. Quick, 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 quick. Move, move, move. Three, two, and time. Our last exercise. You're going to do this one? All right. Kristen's going to do it. I'm going to let her have the last bit of fun. Oblique jacks, two per side. One, two, or you know what? It's the last one. It's only 20 seconds. Let's just go continuous side to side to side to side. Let's go. Three, two, let's get wacky with it. There we go. Oh, that's wacky. This has got to run. I actually had a run. I had a run. Yeah. Yeah. If you get that run going, then you got to still get side to side. Get those obliques, hammer them out. Oh, yeah. There we go. We got a few people running it. Love it. You got five, four, three, two, one. You are done. Woo. Awesome job, team. Great work tonight. That was a little bit crazy, but you made it. A little bit of kettlebell, dumbbell, lots of crazy cardio, Ooh. and lots of core. Shake it out a little bit. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> that just flew by. It was so quick. Uh huh. Reaching sure. up, coming down, reaching up. Well, this is my third workout for the night, so I'm not uh -huh. not sure what's flying by for you, but down, stay I'm down. I'm feeling a little bit haggard. Haggard? Yes. Ah, like rural haggard? Like haggard. <laughs> Hands down, straighten those legs up, push those feet back, or the glutes back. Feet are forward, you can brace yourself on your quad, as Kristen is, or on her shins, or just be on the floor. Whatever you got, as long as you can feel those nice hamstring stretch, then come over to one side. One reach here. And switch sides. So again, Saturday morning, eight. 30, not eight, not nine, but 8.30, right in the middle, we are going to have our first ever combat conditioning camp, 60-minute online class. You don't want to miss it. It's, uh, it's going to be a ton of fun. I've been wanting to do this for a while, so finally got the green light to go for it, so it's going to be, uh, going to be a great workout. Back to center. Let's bring those be in, we're gonna step one out, nine degrees. Get that nice side lunge. Nice long lunge here. And we'll rotate that back leg. Getting that hip flexor. And then we'll come all the way over. Other side, side lunge. That well, was pretty crazy. Yes, it was. Nice to throw in a little bit of kettlebell type stuff. Throw a little bit at home. And rotate that back leg. Oh. And for all of you on YouTube, welcome. A little bit of, of kettlebell style fun. We don't do it very often, but it's nice to do it. If you've got the toys. And let's bring both legs back, drop those knees down, drop those hips, get that nice little arch looking up, get that extension on the neck, lift the chin. Oh, that feels good. Take a nice deep inhale. Exhale, slowly drop the chest down. Push back so your glutes are sitting down on those heels. Extend those arms as far as you can. And really, really enjoy the stretch going all the way up your spine. If you push back with the glutes, you'll also feel a little bit into the upper, upper glutes, maybe a little bit lower. I was going to say my lats. Yes, you're also going to feel the lats for sure. Shoulders, triceps. Tuck your chin in. Take a nice deep inhale. 
Exhale slowly and round your spine a vertebrae at a time. Awesome job tonight, everybody. Thank you so much for coming out and joining us. We will see you for a little Beauty and the Beast combat, um, combat conditioning Saturday, 8.30 a.m. Don't miss Wouldn't it. Wouldn't you have just called it the mini and I letter? No. <laughs> have a good one, everybody. We'll see you. Take it easy. If we don't see you, have a great weekend. Ira, I'm sorry if I'm saying your name wrong. Coach Mark's going to have to clarify that because I saw him. He was pronouncing it differently than I was. And I was like, uh-oh, I think.